electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Guess I was wrong. Can always look for another shop where they won't ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border. That's fine. Step aside. What? Got any idea what to do? <clears throat> hmm. I'm gonna bypass the coupling and rig a hot wire. Compressor will run on and on. It could seize up. Did anyone ask your opinion? See what happens. It's like I was telling you. No. Not shabby at all. Questions how long it'll last you. And it'll get me to Night City. I figure something else out there. Right. Mm-hmm. Antenna on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. Not liable to him much. You don't say. Hey, Mike. Didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a few hours past. I I, I thought uh, he'd at least called in. Don't you swear to Mike. We're gonna hash it out. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. I can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver showguns? Ring any bells? I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do ya? That a nomad vehicle? Might have expected that. I'll just fix it and go. I've no reason to linger. <sighs> nope. You sure shit don't. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Where'd your clan pitch camp? There is no clan. There is no camp. I'm here alone. I ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Sure as hell hope you'll be on your way before long. I saw broadcast in comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down, and I need to radio someone. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? I've made it clear. I don't want any trouble. Then stop looking for it, and hit the road, quick.
Hello? Come in. Come in. Ah, raised you finally. Willie McCoy, it's good to hear your voice. Fee. Wish I could say the same. I need your help. One last time. One last time. Again? I have to find a client with my payload, but I don't know where he is. Hmm. Right place, right time. You were there? Of course I was. Maybe the client left a message. Could you check for me? Hmm. Sure. Last time, though. I mean it. Client's name? Jackie Wells. Huh. Actually left a message. He's waiting on a farm. Flicking you the geolope data. Thanks, Willie. I owe you one. You do. Just don't get yourself killed. And don't call again. I was worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. I believe I am. Are you... Name's Jackie Wells. V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. Oh, where I'm from, you share a bit about your soul before you talk biz. Eh? It's kind of like a custom. Or just good manners, you know? Why don't we start with you, then? NC Native, right here. Got Haywood in my blood. I've never been to NC. That doesn't mean much to me. So, imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a <laughs> distant cousin, at least. <laughs> I think I understand. You don't have to like each other, but it's family. That's Haywood. That and everyone's back in iron. And you? I guess one could say I'm from my own Haywood. You and me, we're gonna get along fine. Cargo. Let's load it in the car. Oh, we will. Started thinking you might not come. I got held up. And you weren't exactly easy to find. I decided to lay low, you know? The sheriff he looked like one grouchy motherfucker. Yep. So, we headed out?
You have the manifest from the transport? Of course I do. But the fixer didn't give you the job deeds. He... he did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? Hey. You, uh, sure you moved contraband before? Why, are you nervous? Me? Scan us and check our papers. <sighs> okay. I'll do the talking. Security check will begin shortly. I got a real bad feeling about this. Hand me the manifest. Don't need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. <laughs> it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. It means the cargo is flagged as to be lost as soon as it crossed the border. Oh. So they know we're smuggling. They're about to find out. The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. <sighs> Chingana madre. What now? Relax. It's all in line with procedures. It's all part of the plan. Hey, guess you know what you're doing, huh? I want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docus. We'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh. Yeah, <laughs> forgot about that. Right, you forgot. I'll keep the engine running in case of a cock up. Do that. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Now please report to room number two. Please sit. Papers. Is this routine? It might be. We'll see. Hmm. What are you transporting? It's all in there. Everything? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which Nomad Clan? I don't think that's any concern of yours. Is that what you believe? You know, whenever I see someone like you, I'm oh so grateful not to be on that side of the table. The feeling's mutual. Go on now. Your associate's waiting for you in the car. Don't forget to take your personal items. Be careful with that toy. And welcome to Night City. Those little shits imagine Night City is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Young, naive... What happened in there? Just a euphemism I'll tell you soon. We need to get out of here. Yeah, okay. Tell me what happened back there. Drive, Jackie, just drive.
Someone's coming our way. This does not look good. Stop your vehicle immediately. Let's get out of here. On it. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. Damn. Stop here. Place looks deserted. Gotta stop here. Need to sort out a few things before we go on. Fuck you, hijo de la chingada madre! I almost tagged our asses. That what you call smuggling? Chingado! Supposed to go smooth. No problems. Calm down. Sometimes these things happen. This? What kind of shit happens? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please? With no consequences. He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us. And he was right. <sighs> so what now? We've crossed the border. Now you pay me, and we go our separate ways. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm a bit light. I can't pay you now. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corpo crap we're carrying. Huh. And you just figured I would sit by patiently. Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. I was just gonna bust ass and disappear as soon as we crossed over. But you're all right. So you tricked me. Oh, well, apologies for offending the spotless moral code of a smuggler. So, what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Open it. Aw, oh, shit. It says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. And maybe we'll make some heavy money. Oh, mames. A real iguana. A, uh, lesser Antillian, I think. You think he can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gonk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you, uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? I don't have any plans. 
I spent the last years traveling between states with my nomad family. I'll probably be waiting for you somewhere, eh? No. We decided to go our separate ways. That must be tough, huh? I've no one to go back to. But don't you worry. Let me help you find Diggs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like, uh, family. Maybe you'll find your own down in Night City. Thanks. Much appreciated. Hey, come on. It's nothing. They got chemistry, you and me. Be a crying shame to waste it. Partner. Hey! Aw, cuddly little fucker. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. The chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to, uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Mañana. Mañana. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Dorset. Target's Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. 
charming. Bug, you could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? Call a damn helpline. Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep a looking.
Are we fucking late? Is that her? Is that our target, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market say to take repros. Typical back alley fix-ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. Oh, 
you're not the last of them. Move on, move up. Be behind you, V. Yeah! 
on this shit. Focus! Rookie's in looks out on the balcony. Got a window on the left. Give me two sets to grease the lock. Mano, get his attention. Attack on the door's just clear. Watch yourselves. Take this, cabrones! Here. Don't see any movement on the sensors. Looks like you got them. You're clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Oh, this does not look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neurocord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomod. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Oh, fuck. She's flatlining. V, need to know what's Jackie, going on. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Hey, catch, vato! I think... 
Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabrón. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. Listen, Mano, I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a date with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? Only if you hang hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. <sighs> Saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. She's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you are to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Stop digging Night City. City like any other, just bigger. Nah, mano, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Wayland, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Man, I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie. They're locking down Watson, remember? Oh, shit, man, you're right. Is it just me, or...? Oh, fucking knew it. Man on our ass, tailing us. I don't... I don't like this deal. I'm one time bit. Gas! Hijo de puta! Fucking drive, Jackie! Come on, B, shoot! Can't! Keep her steady! 
Hold tight, V! Mierda! Perdón! V! Aim for the driver! Chingado! Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry. It's okay. Baby. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Stops. What does the lockdown to for the Nerdist? Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your... girl? Uh-huh. Gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. Is she giving me a chance? Waiting. Hmm. That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay. On your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? Um, always? I'm always never not nice. in when things fly out of hand. Gonk's out there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, she was over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Chill, V. Don't let me through. Sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Sweet dreams, then. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Ahí luego.
Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deets. Praise be to me. I might have caught something when I jagged into that corpo's biomon. Dunno, uh, neurovirus, or... I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw in some threads, meet me downstairs. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, B. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. To mark the event, the streets of Night City will come alive with exclusive story Dashi floats. The festival program will also include... for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And, in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you a safe and fun Matsuri. Enjoy yourselves, Night City. After the break, Cyber Psychosis. long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. So 
So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. All right, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Not really, no. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Stop. Ripper Duck. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Man, Miss Don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know? Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dex to Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in.
You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic, and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. Oh, beautiful. Time for the scanner. Take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er-did well. It ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. 
Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. And avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride. For you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked. Next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Hello? Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see? Convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. 
Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang mate one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> Anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Claim to want to check our pro cred, but to me it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it, then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> on. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego.